So hey you guys, look what we got! We got a Deadpool Marvel Legends series Deadpool. Um, wow, this is kind of cool. You see there he's in the box, stood looking damn handsome with his selection of hands. Um, burrito, a couple of different heads, that head, a couple of different guns. Yeah, knives, forks, spoons, the works. Um, I like this. Okay, side artwork on the box there. Nice, it's got that metallic -y feel to it again, which is good. Artwork on the back there, him giving the big thumbs up from the man himself. Uh, selection with the swords, packs and things, the other head, and the other head and the blaster. And around this side there he is eating his taco, burrito, whatever you want to call it. I guess it's Berea. Does it say on the back? Let's have a look. Because the other one did. Some person may recall. No. Does it say on the bottom? No. There's all the little easy stuff on the bottom. So, let's see if we can open up this sellotape without opening up too much. There we go. I'll tell you what. I've just remembered. No, he did it through the top for once. Wow. Okay, can't find a knife, so we'll do that. There we go. Brilliant. So Deadpool has become one of those great legendary figures, characters, people, that now we can't remember what life was like without him. That is a pretty cool figure. Okay, so we pop him out. There's a little introduction book up there. Oh, that's nice. Look, he's got them on the thing, but uh, they were upside down, so I guess... Guess who took it out of the box earlier, put it back in upside down. Okay, really weirdly packaged because the swords are through there, which means if you try and take him out, you ain't gonna succeed. So we shall remove the swords and pop him out. There we go. Right, I'll put that bit down there. So there he is, the man himself, the man in tights, Deadpool. And what a good look. Oh, nice articulation on him there. Yeah. He's not quite sturdy. I like the boots. Yeah. And there we go. Oh, that's weird because that, as you can see, is kind of firmer. So it, it's going to sit strange. There we go. Right. So the swords go in. Sorry, the katanas go in that way. Oh, they've got a lot. I like that. They lock. There. That's good. I'm not going to push them too far. Um, the guns on the belt sadly are glued in, which is a shame. He has got a place there for the knife. That one's also glued in. Um, look, check out the boots. Very nice. Now, let's get these legs straight. Will he stand all by himself? Yes, he will. That is a very nice stand. Right, now let's see what else we've got in here. We have uh, four set of hands. There's little knives. I'm going to leave the little knives in there because all of them, it just goes in there. Um, so you have that one which is for eating his lunch. And then two other ones which are gun. These are gun hands. They are sort of more positionable hands as you can see and we've also got one that is a fist because at the moment he's got his big thumbs up finger in there hand in there see another fist and they do have pegs on the end of there which are maneuverable oh yeah um, okay it comes with two guns so i don't know if you guys can help me out with this does deadpool Harry guns that look like this in the comics. Okay, we have that gun, which looks like something out of uh, Halo. Very nice with his name printed on it. That now makes sense to me why they had guns like this when I was in America. So yeah, not uh, people would remember them, but they had some Deadpool guns that had his name on, on that logo. So yeah, kind of like that. I get the other gun. There we go. Now, that one. 
which is kind of nice. It would have been nicer if they'd have given these guns with it as well, some guns like that. I mean, these are good, but I guess this is because they don't want to give real guns away with toys. Yeah, but right down there. And he comes with two separate toys. Okay, we've got one of them out of the packet. out round one. Right, let's just move him because it's going to focus on him, lay him down, and not on this little guy. There we go. That is the Wade Wilson Deadpool face. And on the side there, I like, look at that cheeky little smile. And slightly yellow teeth, which is nice. I like the, the pearlescent paint that they've put on the eye there. I don't even see that. It's not quite silver, it's not quite, it's pearlescent. Little knobbing on the back there, rips in it. And the other one he has, which is this one, which is his definitely dead. <laughs> well, there that is. Yeah. Hello. How are you doing? Um, a great little eye in there, and little helicopter hat. Look, wee. Round it goes, wee, wee. Yeah. Pretty cool looking figure. I like it. Yeah, like I say, he, articulation wise, he has got the double joints, see, there we go, he has to cut like, the double joints there, so the manoeuvrability, let me bring a bit of light around this side, there we go, manoeuvrability, and I'm up and down, elbows, not the best, they are double, but not the best of Oh, actually, better than I thought. So you can do... Who's the coolest guy in the world? This guy! And only has one thumb. Because he only has one hand with one thumb. Shame they didn't give him two thumbs, then he could have done that. Pose, couldn't he? Yeah. Um, legs, same thing. Double joint. Not quite a butt kicker, but he's close. And that's where the other knife goes. Ha ha! And I guess that's where the gun goes as well. One of the guns. Not with a burrito, would it? He has got a stand with him. I'm not sure quite what the stand is for. Because he's not kind of... He's not a flying sort of character, but there's that. If you can see it. Stand. Hmm. So I'm trying to figure out... Nope, no idea where that goes, but I'm sure one of you will tell me what that's for. Yeah, I kind of like it. The, the, you've seen, obviously, my Captain America, Iron Man, Thor. Uh, who else did we do? Captain America, Iron Man and Thor. Figures in this collection. And I, I like this, yeah? The interchangeable hands are good. And it's got a sense of humour to it as well, because like I say, we have... I mean, look at that. Mm. Man, you'd have to be indestructible to want to eat that, wouldn't you? But I like this. That, that's that's like a toy designer having fun that's gone, Hey dudes, wouldn't it be cool to put like... Yeah? And they actually give him a... I say they've given him a hand... To hold it with. Which is pretty amazing, yeah. That's all that hand does is hold his taco. Impressive. Most impressive. Yeah, I like that. I must admit though, the only thing is with the with the other heads, I wouldn't know which head I don't know which head to put on. I mean or well, that one. Because you've got three cool heads there. That one, which isn't really 100% sort of like Deadpool, but still fun. That one that feels very Deadpool, but the rest of his clothes aren't that ripped, so... Mm. So yeah, I'm probably going to leave him 
looking as sweet as he does. Like I say, nice figure, stands well. If I have any sort of gripes, it's maybe that this feels a little bit solid, so it's not going to sit quite right. But maybe with a bit of hair dryer, a bit of talent, she reshaped that. Um, and yeah, maybe these guns would have been nice as proper guns rather than just guns that are glued into his outfit. But other than that, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. So if you've got this far through this video, what I would really like you to do, really helps the channel, etc. is subscribe. Subscribe. Okay. These aren't my teeth. I'm breaking them in for the dog. Like, share and subscribe would be brilliant. It really, really does help the channel. I'd like to thank all of you out there that have subscribed, liked and shared. You really are helping the channel. Um, but we still need to get to a thousand. So, I hope you all have a great day. I hope you all have a great night. And me and Wade will see you in the next video. Yeah, do you want to go for a taco? Yeah, okay. Uh, you forgot your wallet. You mean your wallet doesn't look good in that outfit? Well, you've got all them pouches. You must have some money in the pouch. Oh, okay. Right. Should we get a taxi? Sounds like a plan.